Hi, uh, I'm at the NAM 19 Electron booth with Rockon, and uh, here we're going to show the Electron Overbridge 2.0. And uh, I have the Ableton set up here, and on this track I have a DigiTac plugin, uh, which is right here. And with this digit, with the plugin, you can instantly see what you're doing on the machine. It's very responsive, and all the settings can be changed on the plugin or on the machine at the same time. So it's a it's a user interface that you can see all the parameters on a nice machine on a nice interface like this. And uh, at the same time, we can send multi-track um, audio streaming. So all of these tracks, if I solo these. All of these tracks are being sent individually, as you can see here. It's very nice to see these green uh, lights bouncing up and down, I think. And uh, because um, the audio goes through the plugin, the, the, the plugin and then through Ableton, I can add all these different effects to the source of the audio. So let's press play. And this is all is coming from a Digitac here, as you can see. And these are all the individual channels. All of them there. And if I go here, I have a little MIDI controller hooked up here, which I have assigned effects to. So let's uh, try messing around with that. stuff that the computers allow you to do. Another thing that I want to show you is um, the sync feature. We, we can offer, we offer near sample accurate sync and uh, let's hear that. So I have a loop playing here. It sounds pretty really tight. Let's try the other loops. plugins and your samples and your loops playing in sync with electron sequences via overbridge. The next thing I want to show you is the analog heat plugin. I have a track here with the analog heat plugin right here. And of course it's the same thing. You change stuff on the machine, you see it on the screen also. So I'm gonna load my presets here. And uh, yeah, let's try running the audio of the DigiTax through the analog heat only via overbridge. Notice here that I don't have any connections in a route. So I'm gonna transmit the audio, digital audio USB into the computer, then from computer to analog heat via USB again, and then back out. And you get a quite a low latency on this. Let's check it out now. So, so now it's going through here as you can see. Analog heat overbridge plugin, you have an analog effect processor for your DAW, for your connected external gear, and all the overbridge devices. What I really like doing also is sending these uh, break beats into the Digitax, and you get a pretty flat result. Let's uh, check that out now. So this is without it, it's without it, so I'm gonna put it on. This is like a compression effect. I already have some distortion to it. And if without it, it's like this, boring. And now it's kind of excited. You know? So yeah, you can use uh, the plugins like this also. Next thing that I can show you, let's get rid of Ableton. And if I launch the DigiTac application, I can basically run the whole Overbridge thing on its own separate application. And here it is. 
So you don't really need to use Ableton or any other DAW to use Overbridge. And of course this application gives you an ability to record all the audio tracks at the same time. And, or maybe even just a selected one. Even the inputs can be treated as like a separate uh, source of audio. Meaning that all the Overbridge devices can use an audio interface. So Overbridge plugin is now available as a public beta. And uh, you can you can find this on Electronauts uh, forum. And uh, soon it's going to be available as a full release once we've done the Digitone plugin because that is missing right now. And uh, right now we're getting a lot of um, feedback from our users and uh, making things more work, making things work better and more stable. Uh, so that's it. Thank you very much for making this video rock on. Thank you.